This is called osteochondritis desiccans. As the dog's going through a growth spurt, cartilage grows out off the end of the bone, and mm -hmm. that leaves room for the bone to grow in behind the cartilage. In Leo's case, that cartilage grew out, but the bone never caught up. So he's got an especially large um, section of cartilage at the end of that shoulder bone. What then happens is because you have a thicker piece of cartilage, you lose stability in the joint. And that loss of stability creates more friction in the joint. And what can happen is there's some pitting in that bone and it's creating a flap in the cartilage. Well, when that flap develops, it allows fluid to enter into the, the space created by that flap of cartilage. And that causes more irritation in the joint, more inflammation, so the body sends more fluid. And so it's kind of an ongoing issue. So what they're gonna do for Leo is they're gonna open that shoulder up, they're gonna go in, they're gonna shave that flap of cartilage that's already developed off. And then if they think any other sections of it are just a little too thick in the cartilage, they're gonna go ahead and shave that cartilage down. That'll help stabilize the joint. And without the flap there, he won't be holding fluid in that joint anymore. The inflammation goes away, his limp goes away, and he's a healthy boy.